Hey up everybody, I'm continuing with cylinders then, uh, you saw in my last video where I fitted them onto the frame etc, yeah they're taking shape now, there's just a, a few odds and ends to tie up, there's the drain cock holes to do, um, there's the valve chest covers to do, so I've got some cardiovascular work to do to cut some pieces of cast iron out for them and uh, you know various other little bits and pieces then there's all the internal parts to make the piston the piston rings the piston rod the valve the valve spindle etc etc yeah so there's a lot a lot to work to do on them yet but not so much work on the outside of them anyway i'm starting to waffle here so let's um, let's crack on and see what i can get done today then That's the covers uh, more or less finished then now, I've got to make 10 studs for each side, that's 20 studs to the correct length and then I'm going to be making, uh, I think I'll make some brass domed 
nuts to fit on rather than just putting standard steel nuts on. What else to do then? The steam pipe that's coming from uh, from here I've got to put two holes in the valve chest for the steam pipe manifold I've also got to put two holes in the bottom of the cylinder here on each one for the automatic drain cocks and I've got to put the lubricator pipe banjo in the center with a modification of a, sc of a screw on the top or a, a little bolt so I can unscrew it and manually and manually uh, lubricate everything if, need if needed like I've done on my meter made okay that's that's the bulk of the cylinders external work done now there's just a few odds and ends to tie up uh, like I mentioned earlier uh, 20 studs to make, 20 dome deaded nuts, uh, the banjo for the lubricator, the manifold holes in the steam chest for the steam pipe and the uh, automatic drain cock holes underneath the cylinders. So yeah there's a few little jobs uh, to tie off here and there and then it'll be on to internals then so uh, I'll call that a day for this one and I'll continue with this in a future video. So uh, if you found that useful, informative etc etc, give me a thumbs up and a subscribe, I'd appreciate that. And I'll catch up next part of this then. Thanks for watching, bye for now.